Okay, so today is Friday and it is officially my birthday eve. Um, I've actually, we're sitting out in the outdoor area because the sun decided to come out for like a couple of hours. And so we were like, okay, we're going to make the most of this. Um, but unfortunately it's getting all cloudy and cold again. Um, but yeah, we're all out here. Brandon's just over there as well. Not paying any attention. <laughs> Hello. Get me out. Cute though. Um, but yeah, we've got the blinds down in the outdoor area because I've been editing the vlog. Um, it's funny. I've just edited our vlog that is going up tomorrow. So tomorrow is my birthday. Like I said, it's birthday eve tonight. Um, this one will be going up tomorrow and it's our anniversary. So it's from last weekend celebrating our anniversary and Brandon's cooking um, for me and like making cocktails and stuff. Well, because we're back in lockdown and because my original birthday plans are now all cancelled, he's actually going to cook for me again tonight and make me cocktails again to at least make it feel a little bit special and a little bit like my birthday. Um, yeah, so that's kind of updates. That's kind of what we've done today. It sucks because it's my niece's, um, it's her first birthday on Sunday as well. So our original plans to celebrate her first birthday are all cancelled as well because we're not able to do anything, which is really, really like, it's really, really shit, honestly. I had a COVID cry this morning. That's what I'm calling them now. I'm calling them COVID cries. I actually was talking to my friends about it earlier. Um, it's basically when you just, you have a moment and you just cry. <laughs> about all the stuff that's going on. Um, it's getting pretty hectic, uh, like, where we are located. Um, we're in a regional, like, a regional part of Victoria. And pretty much, like, even though we've been in lockdowns and we spent most of last year in lockdown, um, we haven't had too many local cases. But now, all of a sudden, we've got so many local cases. Um, it's getting kind of wild. Both my sisters and my mum, they all work at the hospital. So, they sort of, you know, they're, they're seeing kind of what's going on up front. Um, and yeah, I don't know. It's just a lot. So I had a COVID cry this morning. I'm feeling much better now as a result. I've had my moment. I've dealt with my feelings. I've let them out and I'm back. Um, and I'm really looking forward to tonight. There's also a new episode of Morning Wars out. I'm obsessed with that show. Um, so after dinner, we can at least watch another episode of that. Maybe watch a movie. Um, and just, yeah, make the absolute most out of my birthday tomorrow that we can. Um, we are, like I said in my last video, we are still allowed to have like a small, you know, picnic. It can only be, it has to be fully vaccinated people, maximum of five people, uh, including children, and it can only be from two households. So um, I'm still hoping to be able to see my mum tomorrow and I'm still hoping to be able to see my sister at some point tomorrow. Um, it's better than nothing, you know, it's at least I get to see the people that I care about. I'm obviously not going to get to see any of my friends or anything, which sucks, but it is what it is. Um, yeah, so those are updates. That's where we are at. It is 20 past four. I've got to do a thumbnail and then after that is done, I am finishing work early. It is my birthday Eve. I'm hoping to be finished work by 5 p.m., which honestly is early. Like I said in last week's vlog, and actually the launch, oh, honey, that's exciting. Yeah. This vlog will be going up after we've launched the new products. It will. Oh, this one that I'm filming right now, not the one that oh, I just edited. That you're editing. Yeah. Yeah. That's exciting. I hope everyone likes them. Yeah. Well, what do you guys think, Brandon? Seriously, workaholic, making everything so perfect. Mm. What's that? Is that what they do? What's that thing? Bellissimo. Oh, there it is. There it is. Um, so, yay. We hope you guys like the new products. This is exciting as, uh, like I said, uh, I'm pretty sure I told you guys in last week's vlog, it's not the product from the whole carbuncle that happened a few weeks ago. It's not the main launch, um, but we're excited to still have new products for you guys. These products we have been working on for ages, so it's at least still very exciting. And hopefully the new ones, Brandon has just confirmed with me whilst I was editing, because he was listening to me talking in the vlog, me talking about stuff that I clearly had gotten wrong. The other new product we're hoping to launch at the start of November, which bubs is not that far away. Start of November, no. What kind of start are we talking? Like four weeks. 
When Brandon's writing emails and working, I ask him a question and he typically will respond about 30 seconds later. I'm a typical bloke. <laughs> no, you're not. Concentrate on one thing at a time. No, Bobby, you're working hard. It's okay. Um, so yeah, it's not that far away. Exciting, exciting, exciting. Gonna have a good night tonight. Going to try and not be sad about missing out on my birthday. <laughs> we can reschedule it. It's funny, last year, because we were in lockdown and because of all the stuff going on, we were like, okay, next year we'll have like a big 30th to replace not being able to have a big 30th last year. But we're in lockdown again, aren't we? The joys. So, those are updates. These two are so cute when you take them walking. <laughs> Georgie does her own thing. But Emma and Annabelle, look, as soon as I got the camera out to vlog it, they've yeah. stopped doing it now. See this? They walk side by side like this, glued to each other. <laughs> it's so cute. Finally stopped raining, so we're actually out for a little walk. Birthday Eve walk. I'm earning my dinner that Brandon's going to cook me. Oh, hello. That's interesting. Um, but yeah, it's beautiful out here. The rain's actually stopped for a moment, which is nice. I am spoiled rotten. Look at this guy hard at work, making me my favorite vodka pasta mm. for my birthday Eve. And I have just made him a cocktail. Thank because you. those who giveth are those who receiveth. <laughs> <laughs> taketh away. Taketh and giveth. Can you taste your cocktail, please? I'm uh, I'm curious to know what you think. Very curious to know. Yeah, it's not bad. It's called a corpse reviver. Ooh, consider me revived. <laughs> I'm now a zombie. I'm one amaretto sour down, but I'm probably gonna switch to vino. What are your thoughts? Yeah. I think it's time because, oh, is it time to put the bread in? I reckon. Mm -mm. Yeah, I think I'm going to switch to, I'll choose a, a wine for dinner and I'm going to switch to wine, I think. He's not letting me help with anything because it's birthday eve, Ew. but I've done a sneaky and I've put the bread in. <laughs> I did it without you even noticing. That's how quick I am. I'm so quick. Keep an eye on you. Um, I was wondering if you had two seconds between grating the parmesan and stirring the... I could stir the sauce. Nope. Oh, but I've done it. <laughs> what are you going to do? <laughs> um, would you, sir, be able to help me choose a wine? Ooh. It's something I struggle with. Look, I've put a little stool here because I'm way too short to reach the wine. <laughs> Oh, Pinot with chili, with spicy chili. Which ones? We do love that one, don't we? Um, I just found this and I don't even know why we've got it. Oh, do you want to go on Italian wine? Oh, <gasps> yes. Italian vino. Okay. You've sold me. This one? Oh, don't drop it, Nikia. Oh, yeah. Yep. Is that a good choice? Yep. <gasps> Yay! Okay. Fabulous. Tonight's candle of choice, by the way, is Boy Smells Cinder Rose. Another really delicious one. He's ready. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, he's been perfecting the sauce. He's adding salt and pepper, and then more salt, and then more chili oil, then more salt. And now the pasta. Pasta resistance. <laughs> that was a really weird laugh. I feel weird about <laughs> what just happened between us. I don't ever want you to mention this. Yeah, never again. Let's just not talk about it. This looks so good and juicy, Bob. Shall I get the bread out now? I bread, I get it. Yes. <laughs> I bread, I get the bread. <laughs> oh, we're fogged up. I'm still not allowed to really help with anything, although he has allowed me to get the bread out. So I'll take what I can get. Birthday Eve. Birthday Eve in lockdown. Um, oh, darlings. Look at them. Oh, but seriously, 
There is nowhere I'd rather be. That's the truth. <laughs> Macaroni in a pot. <laughs> Guys, half of the stuff that I have to cut out of these vlogs because it's totally not a problem. What are you doing? <laughs> oh my god. I reckon it takes me twice as long to edit these because of all the inappropriate stuff I have to cut out. <laughs> it is what it is. You can't contain this. No, you can't. 11 years and the passion is going strong. <laughs> oh my god, dinner's ready. Look at this, you guys. Have you ever seen, oh, food porn, <laughs> absolute food porn. So we're going to sit down and have dinner and then we're probably going to watch some Netflix. But thank Butter. you, thank you. Oh, I've got it. I've got it here. Thank you for birthday Eve dinner. Yeah, well, You're amazing. Happy, happy birthday Eve. Making the most mm. of lockdown is what this is. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Yay. Thank you, baby. We bought the poms. I woke up this morning, it's my birthday, and I wanted to come and go for a walk. That's what I felt like doing. So it's actually flooded <laughs> again overnight. Sort of. It's actually gone down a fair bit now. But the little pommies, we just let them off the lead. And they don't even want to go play. <laughs> no, they're exhausted from the walk. They just want to stay with you. <laughs> Annabelle's like, hold me like a baby. Carry me the whole way home. <laughs> <laughs> she could literally do this for hours. Go, Emmy! Oh, she's lost There's it. There's so oh. many sticks. Which stick do I choose? <laughs> <laughs> it's like a Roomba. Yeah. A crappy LD one. Yeah. You little gear. I got down the stairs this morning and look at all this lavender Brandon has got for me. I've been banging on for probably the last, do you reckon two weeks? Yeah. About how obsessed with lavender I am. And he got me all this lavender for my birthday. <laughs> It's so pretty. I love lavender. This is Spanish lavender. It's a, uh, oh, it's just fabulous. Brandon is now making me birthday breakfast. French toast, which he's revealed. And French toast on brioche bread. So French, it's- French style. It's even better. French style French toast. That's it. That's how you do it. I've just realized that the logo, you have worn that jumper so much that the logo is actually nearly entirely gone. Yeah. It just looks like a plain grey jumper now. He's made me a cup of tea. I'm here with a candle and the pretty lavender. It's all happening. It is all happening. All oh, the pommies are eating their breakfast too. He won't let me do anything. I tried to help clean up dishes from last night. I tried to feed the girls. It's your birthday. He keeps telling me off like I'm not allowed to do anything. You, you will be waited on. Oh. In yeah, cutie. <laughs> Is that the same? I think so. I could I uh, get around a a full body massage. Ooh, hello. <laughs> uh, you're allowed to make requests today. Oh, today's the day of making requests. Remember when I tried to bargain with you? And I was bargaining you were laughing at me because I was bargaining something that I wanted for something that you didn't want. Yeah. <laughs> And I was like, um... You suck at this, Nakia. <laughs> you suck at bargaining. You suck at bargaining. So funny. Today you are the French toast king. Oh, look at that. I don't even think I've ever actually made it myself. I feel know. like it, mum used to love it when we were younger. I can't remember. Like, I feel like maybe I remember making it for her for Mother's Day. Mm -hmm. Maybe? Um... Yeah. How good is this brioche bread though? Oh, delicious. <sighs> I feel old, guys. Got my rainbow slippers on. 
I couldn't decide what color slippers to wear for my birthday, so I've worn all the colors. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you guys, look at this. <laughs> oh, that looks amazing, baby. Thank you so much. Oh, look, I've got my candle. I've got my lavender. Need some mint. Got my bread. Well, we've got some in the garden. Yeah. That's too much effort. <laughs> Just wait for the pizza resistance. Oh, the pizza resistance. Oh, the maple syrup. Yeah. The sugar free maple syrup. He's made this sugar free for me because I'm off sugar. <laughs> you just, you are too good. He's got it. He's, fit. yeah, they've changed the packaging a bit. Look at this. Oh, stop it. Get out of town. Oh, that looks amazing. Thank you so much. This is. <laughs> it smells amazing. Thank you so much. Yeah. Birthday breakfast. Mm. Mm, just came out of the room back here and look. <laughs> Brandon set up all these birthday balloons as a surprise. You, sir. You, sir, sneaky, sneaky. are too gorgeous. Oh, thank you so much, Baba. You always make me feel so special. Oh, look at my birthday balloons. Hello, hello. You've turned the lockdown home into the party home. That's it. Yes. Oh. Well, well, five if you include the pommies. Six if you include Fifi, but we probably no. won't see her Fifi until it's never dark. Wants the party, no. Thank you so much. I love them. This is so cute. One of my girlfriends just dropped off this present at the front door for me, obviously because of lockdown. <sighs> we couldn't hang out together. Uh, ordinarily, we would have done something, you know, all of us today, but it was so sweet of her to drop a present off. I really appreciate it. But um, I think what we're going to do now is perhaps organize hey, what are you doing emma is being so sus today i'm a little bit sus on them i'm pretty sure that i did explain to you guys we're allowed to have a little picnic so i'm gonna get dressed and we're gonna head down um to a park um and have a little picnic with my mom and my sister Yay. and look <laughs> more cute balloons from brandon isn't he just beyond gorgeous he's just upstairs having a quick shower um i think i need some so i mean would i love to wear my slippers to the picnic absolutely but i probably can't get away with it although it's my birthday so i should be able to get away with it right let's find some socks look at all of brandon's party socks <laughs> they're all in here drying he has like 14 million pairs of party socks these ones here are mine can you tell why Rainbows and unicorns. <laughs> Guys, this is the peak of getting old. Brandon got me these little wooden, what would you call them? Planter boxes? Yeah, planter boxes. For my birthday. And it's the best present ever. I'm so excited. They're so freaking cute. And you've got that. Oh my God. And he's going to paint them white and put like little crosses on them for me. So that they're like Hampton style. Oh, Baba, I love them so much. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Yes, and we're going to plant maybe lavender. Mum got me snapdragons. Snapdragons were always my absolute favourite, favourite flowers when I was little. And she got me some snapdragons so we could put them in there. It smells good. It does. It smells really good, doesn't it? Yeah. Whoa, George is struggling with life hey, George, beside you. <laughs> Oh my god, I love them. Yeah. Thank you so much. This is what makes me feel excited in my 30s. You can all keep your fancy handbags and your, I don't know, <laughs> your jewellery or whatever. This gets me going. <laughs> and this. <laughs> this little monkey <laughs> is having herself quite a moment. You're just wanting to be up here with me, aren't you? I'm going to make a little chai latte, a little sugar-free chai latte. Um, also, look at all my balloons. How spoiled am I? And my flowers, my birthday flowers. I honestly had the best birthday. Oh, actually, I did want to talk to you guys. Um, 
we've just finished having we're having a big shed built out the back it's going to look like a Hamptons pool house it's not even really gonna look like a shed but essentially it's going to be like Brandon's workshop slash shed but um as part of it like we've basically had to wait to landscape the backyard properly we had to wait for the shed to be done before doing it and as part of doing the backyard and um, we're going to be painting like the external fencing you see that like khaki colored fencing I'm thinking a light gray or like an off white so that it looks super Hamptonsy. Um, but I'm curious to know what color do you think we should paint the fence? Let me know in the comments. Oh, the wind has ripped apart our outdoor area again. Stunning, stunning. But hang on, let's go over here. Hey girls, you playing with your new little toys? Here is a close up look at the fence. See how it's like just. I don't know, it's just like a poo brown colour. Um, we've got white fencing at the front and that's sort of like what white fencing looks like up against the house. But imagine all of this fence was white outside. Let us know your thoughts. Let us know what you think because a lot of people paint it like a dark grey, but I don't know, I'm not really feeling dark grey. All right, I look a little crazy, so don't mind that. But... Every single year when daylight savings. So we've just come out of winter into spring, right? So we're changing like, so basically daylight savings has like it now applies and time has moved forward like an hour. I'm cooking dinner. It's, and this happens every single year. And you would think I've been on the earth for 31 years and still evidently every single year, even though we've done it 30 times before now, it still throws me completely off. So it's quarter to seven at night, right? And I'm cooking dinner and it feels like I'm literally making dinner at lunchtime. Even though it's only one hour different. I, I just, every single time this happens, it throws us off completely. But I've just chopped up all these veggies. <laughs> this is another HelloFresh meal, but um, Brandon wanted like a bit more potato, but I thought, oh, you know, pumpkin. Pulled the pumpkin out of the fridge, chopped it up, did not realize it would be this much pumpkin so now we've got like well we're gonna have like a heap of roast pumpkin available for lunch tomorrow i suppose and put this in the oven all right so we're about to start <laughs> everybody is talking about this like all on twitter all of my friends have watched it apparently it's like super messed up super disturbing but here we are about to watch it anyway um let me know in the comments have you watched this and like what the <laughs> What the hell is it all about? So I'm just opening some PR today. I actually have <laughs> a giant pile of PR that I need to open. But I saw this come in today and I saw that it was from Revlon. And I always really love Revlon PR packages. So I've just quickly opened it up. And look, it's like everything that I love in a box. Cocktails and nail polish. I'm so excited. So they've just launched this new nail polish and it's called... Uh, Ultra HD Snap, and basically it's like a full collection of nail polish that dries in only 60 seconds. Oh, how good does this color look? This one looks really pretty. What is the name? No drama. You know what? That's kind of relevant to my life right now. That's kind of perfect. But um, yeah, I'll be testing it out. I might even paint my nails tonight because I haven't got any color on my nails. Um, I always get questions from you guys about my nails. I don't do gel. I don't do shellac. I don't do acrylics. I don't do uh, any of that stuff. I just basically paint my own nails at home. I've never been like a go get, you know, your nails done kind of a girl. Um, but yeah, definitely very excited. These look amazing. And anything that's quick dry, I'm a huge fan of. Um, but yeah, it came with some cocktails, a martini, a Manhattan, and a Negroni, and some snap cards. So I think we should bust out these cocktails and play a game of snap. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> look what Brandon has done to our glorious lawn. <sighs> you, need to you need to explain yourself. <laughs> so, I wasn't happy with it. <laughs> Too much fat. So this is a process called dethatching, and look at all of this he's gotten out of it. So it did look like this, mind you. Beautiful. Oh, it, wasn't that good. it was. Your your mental. Um, so basically, he's mown it down on like the lowest setting, and uh, now it looks rather dead. 
Little I also stronger than ever. I had no prior warning that this was happening. I just want to put that out there. I looked out the window. I was upstairs. I was upstairs in the window. And I looked out the window and I just saw this. It was a shock of a lifetime. This is hard yakka. Yeah, well, I'm about to make dinner, so you'll... I'll tell you what, I've earned it. You're working up an appetite. I'm getting hungry. Oh, are you, baby? Yeah. Well, it's a quickie if you're hungry soon. Nah. I'm just burning off the belly. I'm not going to lie, I'm excited to watch more Squid Game. Yeah. <laughs> See, this is like, look at this. Oh, that's from the tree, I think. It's like tree roots. Oh, so that's all just like dead. Yeah. So you're going to hack all this up and then reseed it? Yep. I'm going to reseed the whole thing. Joy's Louise. Okay. Oh, gosh, it is thick, isn't it? Yeah. That's not, that. that's not even grass. No, it's all the roots and stuff from the grass. Whoa, so the grass was growing out of this. Yep. It's so spongy and amazing though. Well, it's not meant to be spongy. Oh my God. What like carpet. Oh, look at that. Oh. Can you do this bit? I'm in, I'm intrigued. Oh, it's so... Oh my gosh, it's like... Oh. Oh, wow. Oh my God, look at it all just coming out. It's like wool. Yeah, right. I wonder why it's so bad around the tree. Maybe. Except it's only bad around the outside of the tree. <gasps> Do you think that this is why our tree is so shit? Could be. Because it's not getting any water in? Because that's what thatch does, right? It stops the water getting to the roots. Yeah. Creates well, like a new the root. Roots getting into the, into the soil. <sighs> Look at Brandon's chosen socks of the day. <laughs> Aren't they glorious? <laughs> um, yeah, right. Delightful. Okay, dinner is already. The children are also eating their dinner. They're all eating out of each other's bowls, though. Annabelle's like eating all over, like all the way over there. It's weird things happening. Um, but dinner looks delicious. It was a quickie. <laughs> I think we've uh, told you guys how much we love these Hello Fresh cookies. They're so much faster. But I just wanted to say, Brandon sharpened our knives with this knife sharpening gadget that he bought ages ago. It took ages to ship here. Um, yeah, this is a weapon now. I'm kidding you not. I feel like I could cut through the bench. It's insane. But he's pooped after all the thatching. <laughs> he's in there on the couch. Um, we're going to watch Squid Game again. Right, let's get some cutlery. Cutlery. Mm, I'll take dinner in. We're up to oh, episode four. It's uh, getting wild. Okay, I decided, <laughs> and this one has agreed, to do a face mask tonight. I've got two options for you, though. Are they sheet masks? Yeah, they're sheet masks. Does that change your opinion? No, it no? no, you're onto it. Okay, <clears throat> so I've got two options. Glowy and hoey, brightening, or clearing uh, that clears and soothes sensitive skin. Ooh. I'll go the sensitive skin. I'm going to go the sensitive skin one too. Okay, 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 okay. I really am feeling your socks. Okay, so this is the clearing one. Dr. Jart. I feel like it's only fair that you go first. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Do you remember these. how insanely juicy these were last time when we put them Are these them the ones we did? Uh, same brand, but last time we did these ones. <laughs> Microjet. What does that mean? Oh no. Oh, hello. Ooh. Super juicy? Yeah. They were super juicy so last time. So it's the time. white bit that goes on. Because there's like this. The film. There's this mesh. Oh, hang on. Open the mask. Remove the film and apply it to the face carefully. So which bit's the mask and which bit's the film? I don't know. That's all it says. The plastic has got to be. 
Yeah, you must, you surely would remove the plus. <laughs> this is like the perfect thing to do while watching Squid Game. <laughs> Are you a square, a triangle, or a circle? <laughs> oh, look at that intense. Yeah, that's what I mean. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, that surely isn't the mask. No, this is definitely the mask. Oh, you look stunning. <laughs> How does it feel though? Good? Wet. Oh my god, look at Georgie. What's All this right. little flap? Yeah, it's like a... Not sticking because of my whiskers. Oh. <laughs> All right, but you're smoothed and good to go. I'll put mine on now. <laughs> doesn't look scary at all. I mean, sheep masks are never a vibe. It'd be just our luck, like a delivery man will show up or something. Hey, we had a delivery... Oh, it's hard to talk. We had a delivery man rock up here, like, super early this morning. You did? Yeah. I mean, I was awake, so it was okay. Whoa. A couple of cuties. <laughs> It's just not sticking. Is that, and that's because of your... Whiskers. Oh, see, so I don't have that issue. I'll uh, update in 20 minutes and let you know how my skin's feeling. Okay, so update is, it feels amazing and I don't want to take it off. It dries out a fair bit. Oh! <laughs> you! Um, it dries out a fair bit, like when you've been wearing it for a while, but it kind of has like a menthol. Did you say like a menthol? I didn't get that. It feels like... Cold. Yeah. How did your skin feel after now it's up? It's sticky. Shall I take mine off? Do you want a cup of tea? Love a cup of tea! <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah, it is sticky. Cup of tea would make my mm. day. Feels really good though. Yeah, mine's like almost burning cold. Mm. Look at you. <laughs> Oh, ow. All right, let's go make tea. Yum. <laughs> this is the knife sharpening contraption that I was telling you guys about. <laughs> it's uh, quite involved. You're really finessing the art there, aren't you? Yep. He loves it. <laughs> Will Smith doing his job, just working hard for this house. So in the end, I was not able to decide which nail polish color to use. So I have painted my nails with five different colors. The formula is super thick and glossy. You only need like one coat really. It's not streaky, it's not see-through. So yeah, first impression I really like. We'll see how I how it wears. Obviously we need to see if it chips and you know, how long it stays looking this nice. But I don't even have a like a top coat on and it's looking really good. So, so far I'm very, very impressed. Okay guys, so you know how I have been talking. Oh, I might shut this actually because you can still hear the robo back. It's so loud. Love it. Love having someone else. Will, Will Smith, iRobot, hello. Uh, love having it on and it's great, but it's not great for when you're filming because you can definitely hear it in the background. But, so, I have been talking to you guys and I've been telling you guys um, about this new product launch. I mentioned it in last week's vlog. You heard about the absolute debacle that happened with our original product launch. But this launch, we've been able to pull forward um, from the end of November to now. And we are so, 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 so excited. So, I can actually show you what it is now because this vlog will, in fact, be going up after the new products have launched. So, I'm going to show you what it is. Okay, guys. So we have just launched our Supernova Chroma Chef Pigment Collection. We are so excited about this. We've been working on it for such a long time. As you guys know, there is an incredible amount of work that goes into these collections and these products and just so much that happens behind the scenes that you would never even believe. It's crazy. But our Chroma Chef Pigments, if you're not familiar with them, if you've not seen them before, if you've not seen any of our other products... These are magical color changing pigments and they actually change color in different lights. See how this is changing colors? So pink, gold, green, dark green, blue, 
See how it shifts as you sort of like change the direction that the light hits it at? They're absolutely phenomenal. The pigmentation of these is intense. They are pure pigments. So there are no fillers. There are no binders. There is, there's just no crap in these products whatsoever. Um, and we've launched five exclusive new shades and they are all inspired by the colors that you see in a supernova and colors that you see in outer space. They are phenomenal. So we've got UFO here. We have got Gravity. This one's an amazing, it's like a dark purple. And it shifts between like hot pink to blue to teal to gold. It is so insanely pretty. This one here is Galaxy. I absolutely love Galaxy. Then we've got Nebula here. Nebula is another really, really amazing one. Just they, they all shift between about four or five different colors as you wear them. I'll, sh I'll pop swatches on the screen so that you can actually see them. And then this last one here is Meteorite. So these are officially available right now on our website, NikiaJoyCosmetics.com. You can buy them individually, but we also do have like a collection bundle available as well if you wanted to grab all five of these shades. Um, and they are limited edition. So if you're wanting them, now is the time to grab them. I'm so proud of them. They do come in our, like the same little jars that all of our loose pigments come in. Um, just, oh, it took so long to develop these and to get them right and to get, you know, the texture of the pigments right, the texture of the formulation right, to get them just absolutely as you know, strong payoff as was possible. Um, and I'm just so, 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 so proud of them and how they came out. So yeah, they are available now. And this is what we've been like crazy, crazy busy with working on um, all this week. It's just been absolutely nuts. My hair looks absolutely crazy. I washed it last night before I made dinner and then pretty much heaped it in a bun on the top of my head. And um, now, now we're looking like this. But um, yeah, it's... Honestly, unless you've done this before, unless, you know, you're a brand owner, there is no real way to explain how much anxiety, how much, like, stress. And I mean, it's stress, but it's excitement all rolled into one um, that comes with these launches. Like, I didn't go to sleep last night until about 2.30 a.m., um, we're pretty much on top of everything. Pretty much everything is done, but you're still scared, you know, like what are people going to think of the products? Are they going to love them? Um, it's honestly, it's low key terrifying, but I'm, I'm just so excited. I am so like 110% proud of how these products came out. They're absolutely perfect. Oh my gosh. You can see like the color shifting there between like pink, gold, and green. Um, but yeah, it's still like, it, it's a very overall, a very, very scary experience. So yeah, I just you guys think of them um and yeah by the time you see this vlog like uh, like the launch for me like filming this right now the launch is tomorrow so it's 5 a.m tomorrow australian time uh brandon and i may not sleep tonight who knows we probably won't most of the time with launches it's like <laughs> you're just too nervous to be able to sleep so we probably when you see me tomorrow and um, we probably won't have slept but yeah i hope that you guys love the new products we have another launch a big big launch are coming very very soon hopefully within the next four weeks um and then i mean you know heaps more products coming after that as well so things are you know things are definitely happening it is definitely very very exciting um but oh, just thank you so much for all of the support you guys are incredible and let me know in the comments what you think of the new products I'm showing you guys this because I trust you not to judge me and I trust you. <laughs> you know, I feel like we're close enough to be doing this kind of thing now, but this is my desk in my filming room, right? After filming two videos, it, it just gets so hectic. I'm about to clean all of this up. Oh, don't buy this foundation, you guys. It was such a waste. Oh, actually, this arrived in the mail. I did order this. The Catrice True Skin Hydrating Foundation. Um, Tati was going on about this and saying that she loved it. So I am quite excited to test it out. But yeah, look at this. This is from one afternoon of filming. Yeah, it looks pretty on camera, guys. But behind the scenes, oh, obsessed with this powder. It's amazing. Um, but yeah, behind the scenes, not, not as cute as you would think. All right, I've just tied my hair up now because it was a little out of control. But yeah, we really, really hope that you love the new products. I'm so nervous to hear what you think. Um, yay! Hopefully, um, tonight we'll be able to finish work at a reasonable time 
and just relish in the excitement of a new launch, um, you know, cook dinner, be together and oh, hopefully we'll get some sleep tonight. But yeah, I love you guys so much. Can't wait to hear what you think and we'll see you in next week's vlog.